I'm really close. This water is really good. I should probably back up a couple more sips. Sippy, sippy. <laughs> if you know who that's from, you're an OG. Hey, y'all. I start college this year. And if you're wondering, yes, I am nervous. <laughs> But I'm really excited. I thought for the first video of my back to school series, I would film most of the stuff that I got from my dorm because I'm not done dorm shopping or school shopping. But these are most of the things that I bought for college in general that I thought I would share with you. So without further ado, if you're interested to see all that I bought for college and my freshman year, keep watching. Okay, a couple disclaimers. One, this is in no way, shape, or form to boast or brag. I am extremely grateful for all the things that I have gotten, and I have great family members and friends who help me accumulate all of this stuff. So I just want to say thank you to y'all. And this is just a nice little tool that the classes behind me can use to maybe see things that they might want to take to college with them or they might want to buy in college or for college. And also, too, there are a couple items in this haul that are... Not strange, but not things you would think you need for college. Um, my case is a little different. I'm going on a backpacking trip the day after I move into college with my major. I'm really excited, but that's why I have a few like outdoorsy things that you wouldn't really need for normal college living. Because I still do think they're good things to have, but um, they're not necessary for college. Okay, I'm gonna stop rambling and I'm gonna get into the video, all right? All right, so I'm gonna start with some clothing pieces that I got. As a matter of fact, I'm just gonna knock out all the backpacking stuff now so that we can get into the real college stuff that I bought. These leggings are Colorful Koala, the best brand of leggings I've ever worn in my life. They're extremely comfortable, they're breathable, they're high-waisted and they don't fall down. They're squat proof. I mean, the list goes on. These are just amazing leggings. The only problem is they are synthetic, um, they're not organic cotton or anything, but because I'm going backpacking, they recommend that you bring synthetic clothes, so that's what I'm going to do. I'm an inexperienced backpacker, so I'm going to listen to people that know what they're talking about. So I got an olive green pair, I got a like ice blue pair, I got this pink pair, and then on the way are a red pair and a black pair, and I am really excited. I love those leggings. I will always hype them up always i also got a hiking hat um a lot of the stuff just came in the mail so i haven't busted it open but i got this hiking hat i'll actually open it now um, funny thing enough i just came from my family reunion a couple weeks ago and one of my family members had this hat and i was like whoa i really want one it's actually very cute and I have one now, and I'm happy that I had a reason to buy one. It's going to protect me from the sun and my forehead from burning when I'm hiking through West Virginia. So I also got a yellow sunglass strap because I don't want my sunglasses falling off my face. Then I also got a solar charger because I was watching backpacking videos, and I definitely want to vlog this experience, and I don't know what phone on the planet Earth last three days um while recording so i got a power bank the last thing i got for hiking so far at least are some hiking socks um these are just some synthetic um comfortable socks that i can wear in my boots so that i don't um you know get super uncomfortable because we're gonna be walking quite a few miles every day that's all the stuff that I got for my backpacking trip. Um, just to wrap up the clothing, I also got this black sweater from Cotton On because I don't have like a normal black sweater that you can just lounge in or dress up or dress down. So I thought that this would be kind of essential thing for my closet, especially because I'm going to be switching to a little bit more of a minimalistic wardrobe when I go to college. Um, and I thought this was really essential. These are some backpacks that I got. I got this one in Jamaica um, from a craft market. It's just like a, I call it my hippie sack, 
but it's so cute. It's made of like patched cloth and you can wear it one strap, you can wear it two strap and then it folds together into like a circle bag and you can carry it like that. I that was super duper cool and it's probably what I'm going to be using as my actual backpack. And then I also got a Kavu which I plan on going on hikes and stuff in college since where I'm going is a lot closer to mountains and hiking trails than where I live now. So I definitely want to go on a lot more hikes and backpacking trips, especially after this one next week. So I got a Kavu. Um, oh crap, I forgot about this. So for the backpacking trip, they said that we should bring two one liter bottles and um one liter is about i think 34 fluid ounces or 33 fluid ounces something like that so my hydro flask is actually close to a liter and i planned on buying another insulated water bottle for college so i can just cover it with college stickers but i ended i didn't want to buy a hydro flask because those are expensive so i ended up getting a simply modern bottle and i already put one sticker on there it says you are my sunshine it's on a college sticker but i think that it's so cute and i just love that saying but yeah it's a simply modern bottle it is awesome it is extremely comparable to the hydro flask and i actually like this a little bit more because the mouth is smaller so when i drink water it doesn't just like go all over my face and I know people say you can get a straw top but I like the the handle on the normal top so I don't switch so I got a yellow simply modern bottle and yellow is also one of my college um college's colors so I had to go with that you know like why wouldn't I do that I got an Amazon Echo um I thought this was really essential um it probably is not essential but I thought that it'd be useful because it just makes life a little easier i love alexa alexa is my best friend we can get into some room decor and just actual school things so i got this photo frame as a gift in my um from an aunt and it just says love laugh smile and i think that it is so cute and, oh i'll show you guys my hamper my hamper is my favorite part of my room because it's so cute oh okay this is my hamper it's an elephant. Look how cute that is. And the top just comes off like that. But I'm so excited about this elephant. I think it's so cute. And then it's small, so it's going to force me to do my laundry a lot more often. Since we're talking about laundry, I got some fabric softener, some detergent, essentials. Um, I have some, what are these called? Dryer sheets and some whitening pods. All right, on to some more homey things i have this iron this is the sunbeam steam master and i don't know i saw it on target and i was like that sounds like a legit iron i want that iron so <laughs> it's the iron that i got half the stuff i put in my registry and my family just sent it to me and it just slowly started coming in um these are just um like wall shelves for decor i'll probably just put like succulents on there or some cute plants or it'll probably be where i put my meditation stuff I got this, um, what's it called, hand vacuum. This is the Black & Decker Dust Buster Quick Clean. Um, I have hardwood floors, but I definitely, I plan on putting a rug in the room and putting a tapestry up and all these things. So I'm definitely going on a vacuum, all of that. Some highlighters, these are just the Sharpie highlighters that show you what you're highlighting, like the little clear part. And then, um, some pilot pens because these write so so smooth. I love the way these pens write. And then post its with the brightest colors in the world because I don't like the boring yellow ones. I like the bright colors. Also, I got a Keurig in the blue color. I first thought the blue was really really cute. That's like the one like when I first saw it. The one thing that caught my eye was that it was blue, and I was like, whoa. I need that. I love coffee and tea. Oh, so, Keurig. And also the dining hall is the closest to us. So whenever we want coffee, we don't want to have to shell out money for Starbucks or walk all the way down to the dining hall. So we have our own Keurig and I need to go buy a reusable K-cup because we don't do disposable around here. I think I'm going to move into this bag right here. So I got two. I'm not going to take them out because it was hard enough to get them in the bag, much less take them out and put them back in. So I have these two overfilled pillows. I don't know if they're the self-cooling ones. I think they might actually be, I don't know. But I know they're overfilled pillows for sure. I like really fluffy pillows. My head needs to feel like it's on a cloud. So also from Target, oh my gosh. 
I have these sheets. They have little roses on them. They're so cute. I love them. And then I also have these gold pineapples. Yeah, these gold pineapples are just so cute. I got these um, washcloths and they're yellow because yellow was a really, really cute color. Oh, and if you try to figure out what our theme is while watching me take all this stuff out, you're gonna get confused. Our theme is centered around a picture we found on Pinterest and it's kind of bohemian um, plant filled room. I don't know exactly how to describe it, but um, it's very aesthetically pleasing. And we both have the same style in that regard, so we just copied a picture basically. <laughs> um, but yeah, so yeah. Okay, and but I also got a black comforter. It's all over there and it's heavy, so I'm not gonna pick it up and show you guys. It's just a black quilted comforter. I think you guys know what black quilted comforters look like. Um, I got black because one, I thought it was like a blank, blank canvas. It didn't stay um, easy. And I figured that in this first year of college, I'd be doing quite a bit of stacking and studying. So I got a black comforter. But my aunt convinced me to get a duvet. And these next items are from Ikea because Ikea is superior. It's like Ikea and Target are tied for first. I just love them both, but Ikea is pretty great. But I got this, um, I'm going to butcher this name, but I'm going to try to say it. Akertistel? Akertistel, I think? Akertistel? But yeah, and it's just a really, really cute duvet. It has, um, like a continuous vine going around it. I think it's super duper cute. Also, staying in the yellow theme, I got yellow Tupperware. This is, I think, three in a pack. And yeah. Just Tupperware, very essential for living space. And then I got three dividers for my drawers because with my dorm, they come with a dresser. So I didn't want my clothes directly into the dresser. So I bought little drawer dividers that I could put my clothes into. And then when I need to pack them up, I just take them out and put stuff away. But yeah. I got some silverware. Um, these are the Mopsy. Oh, I didn't pronounce this one. Oh, I'm gonna do that. Oh, this is just scub because scub. <laughs> I got Mopsy um, silverware. I can't speak. <laughs> and yeah, it's just 16 pieces of silverware, um, four big spoons, four little spoons, four forks, and four knives. Yep, and then these are just Pruta. Pruta. I love this. I got this yellow desk lamp and it's called Janshō and yeah it's just it looks like that when you take it out so it morphs it's one of those you can just move it all around and I think it is so cute I got a dish brush also from Ikea um yeah it's just a dish brush I don't know if this has a name and then I got a throw pillow because I got a throw pillow case and yeah this is just a throw pillow I don't know if this has a name either let me repack this stuff back in the bag really fast. Okay, <laughs> now on to the second Ikea bag. I got a cork board for my um, like announcements to myself and reminders and grocery list and bathroom list and just a general cork board because it is pretty important for college. On to the next. I got an ironing board, which, uh, funny enough, my roommate bought the same ironing board, and we tried to stay as um, communicative as we could in the shopping process because they didn't want to duplicate everything, um, at least the things that we know that we both would use. But I mean, we have our own ironing board. It's not the worst thing in the world. Say one day you want to both iron our clothes and we don't feel like waiting, we have our own. So yeah. I've got a dish mat because we have some dishes from when we want to cook a dinner. Because um, on every other floor in my dorm building, there's a full kitchen. So if we want to cook, we can use our dish mat to, um, you know, for our dishes. This is just a mat that is going to go right in front of our door. So when you come into our room, you dust off your feet and take off your shoes because, 
yeah, we don't wear shoes in our room. So, and this is my, the first throw pillow I got. It's so cute. Oh my gosh. I like fell in love with it. It's multicolored. It has every color that is in my room and that everything that I have, um, it's, you know, the color is on here. And I don't know if this has a name. Oh, there it is. Rodarv. It's called Rodarv. I also got this butterfly pillow it's kind of childish looking but i think it is the cutest thing ever and i love butterflies so much and then the back is just like a cute twirly twirly design and this is the sanglarka um pillowcase so if you want this pillowcase it's the sanglarka and then la oh no not last um this pillowcase i got it's called the anastans anastans i think and it's a uh, um 20 by 20 that's gonna go on the throw pillow that I showed you guys earlier and it's really really cute and it's reversible so yeah last but not least from Ikea I got um, a hand towel I wanted at least one set of decorative towels so I got a hand towel and this super cute body towel that is the same print um, not necessarily to match my room just something cute to wrap my body in I actually have like a quick story about orientation and towels and showers <laughs> all right let's get into story mode so basically they provided us with towels and washcloths and linens for orientation when I made my bed I didn't open my towel or the washcloth bag because I was like you know what, it's just a towel and washcloth why am I opening it and before I use it so when I went to go take a shower all I brought was my caddy with my wash stuff because for my orientation we spend the night all I brought was my caddy the bag with the towel and the washcloth um and then I brought an extra washcloth for myself because I use one for my body and one for my face and <laughs> when I got there oh and all I had on were like the clothes that I had on previously before my shower basically I take my shower I go to grab my towel and the towel is literally a little bit bigger than this like the towel was not there it wasn't big at all and I'm not a tiny girl so who what who was that gonna cover like it just it didn't work I had to haul everything and more back to my room covering myself with the square towel they gave me my booty was out it was just not a good situation and I was just running to my room half naked praying nobody would see me happy college <laughs> Um, but yeah, thankfully the bathroom, um, I'm only sharing with three other girls. I have a suite style for my dorm. So thankfully I will not have to haul half naked in the bathroom again. Okay. Story mode off. But yeah. Oh, oh my gosh. I got these two other throw pillows. I want to show you guys them. I'll be right back. Okay. I'm back. Um, you will never guess where I got these. They are so freaking cute. They have tassels on them, and they're colorful, and they look good against this pillow right here. I got those pillows at Dollar Tree. I got these throw pillows at Dollar Tree. They are so cute, and I just had to have them, so I got two. I think that just about does it. Um, I'm not done with college shopping, but I am pretty close. A lot of the things that you may think are essential that I didn't show, um, my roommate might have bought them, so that's probably that's why I'm not buying them. I know she got us like a Brita filter and things like that. I also have a um, oh magic bullet. I have a magic bullet on the way. So yeah, so we can make smoothies and stuff. Yeah, I think that does it. I really hope you enjoyed and I hope this was helpful in um, what you should get for college and things you may want for college. Um, I'm really excited. I am going to keep you guys updated on my getting ready for college journey and things of that nature. This is only video one of my back to school series, so you will definitely see more school related videos. So if you like this video, don't forget to like the video and subscribe to my channel and follow my social media accounts, which you'll see in a couple seconds in the outro. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye. How will you serve the world? What do they need? that your talent can provide. So the effect you have on others is the most valuable currency there is.